Courage is a choice. Let's explore that through some questions. Why do hate and shame get so much attention? Why do people in organizations that espouse hate ha make so much money and have such big followings? These are strong emotions that elicit powerful reactions in people. They are also deeply connected to our sense of identity and social belonging. I grew up feeling hate and shamed. I feel those emotions immediately after maybe judging someone. And that, in the moment, makes me feel really good about myself. And this motivation makes these emotions really contagious. And they spread quickly through social media and social networks, which further amplify these and create a sense of community around hate and shame. And this cycle of conflict continues escalating. And then people get even more entrenched in their positions and are less likely to listen to other people's positions. People in power and authority use these to stigmatize behaviors and then keep control and maintain their power and maintain the behaviors they want. And hate and shame are core to all of these toxicities. We absorb these. I grew up learning hate. I was shamed. I was taught to hate. And what did I do? I just reflected that back. And our culture has an abundance of that. It takes vulnerability. It takes courage for us to look inward and really work to purge the toxicity we have absorbed. Let us take a moment to challenge our thinking and not succumb to the easy allure of hate. Let's choose courage.